As soon as I dropped in today, I saw three bull sharks and the water was not very clear. There's a bull shark, as you can see, to the left of the screen. They were pretty big and they were right there as soon as I dropped in the water. I saw one, two, three as I descended down. And uh, one of them came a little close and then decided, hey, I'm gonna, I'm gonna back off and because that's not any food source or anything. So whenever you drop near a fishing boat, you're, you, might, you might sometimes see a few more of the sharks. Uh, but it was pretty exciting and uh, I got down to the bottom and, and then it cleared up quite a bit. It was very cold down there, about 70 degrees. And uh, that's pretty chilly. Now look at this big guy. Of course, I go for the biggest one first. That was a good sized fish. And here's the smaller of the two. Now these lionfish, like I've said before, some people that are new, they are invasive. It's the only fish that we target at the Lionfish Extermination Corporation. Here is a beautiful green sea turtle. Now these turtles are the most skittish in our area. They very rarely let you get this close. So I got a decent little video. Very rare. This is usually, usually they are gone and out of there and they're very violently running away. But that one was a little more calm, which was kind of cool. The most calm sea turtle on the ocean, uh, especially in our side of the world, is the hawksbill sea turtle. Hawksbill will just sit there and eat and carry on with his business as long as you're not making any sudden movements. And you can just watch it. You can sit right up next to it and put the camera right in its face. And it's no big deal. We don't see them a lot, but we can see them all year round. Uh, pretty, pretty common. And then uh, the next calm will be, well, look at this trunk fish really quick. Now this is a pattern where you see a lot of the pattern and then this other trunk fish, all you see is the spots. I don't know if, you know, they can kind of change their chromatophores and colors. This is a piece of hard coral with the polyps out and that's a Christmas tree worm there. You see the two worms that stick out and swirl. And then we have some nice pretty soft corals. And we have some surgeon fish. Boom. We get quite a few lionfish. We we didn't we only did uh, four dives total, and they weren't quite as successful as some of our other dives. So I actually filleted all these fish last night. So I I got some big fillets and I did a cooking video, which is kind of cool. So some of the fish you're seeing in this were in the cooking video and in my TikTok live that I did. It didn't work that well because the uh, mist there because the um, connection wasn't very good. So next time I'll try to figure out a better connection. Now look at this cute little burfish. He's just slowly going away from me. Now this guy's really cool. This is a queen trigger fish. Super pretty. One of the prettiest trigger fish in the world. We have him right here. So that was it for the dive. I got quite a few. Thanks for watching guys.